In the UK, there are almost 3 million colourblind people. That's enough to fill Wembley Stadium's 90,000 seats more than 30 times. Or, put another way, in a full Wembley, at least 5,500 spectators will be colourblind. So being able to see the team on the left playing in an all-red kit could be a huge issue. And it's not just spectators. Colour blindness can affect anyone involved in football. Players, management, volunteers, coaches, referees, match officials, anyone. But does it really matter? It's not a major problem, is it? Well, maybe not for you. But look at it from our perspective. There are tens of thousands of clubs in England playing football every week, with thousands of kits between them. For those with colour vision deficiency, that means plenty of opportunity for colour clashes. And it's not just the kits. It's equipment like bibs, cones, flags and line markings, facilities and signage, merchandise, accessing information like buying tickets online and even TV coverage. It's enough to put you off having anything to do with football. But it doesn't have to be this way. If you're aware of colour vision deficiency, you can help prevent these problems in the first place. All I'm asking is that you consider colour when choosing your kit combination for your team, your football equipment, your venue and even the information online. It's not rocket science, these are easy fixes. In fact, knowing about and making small changes like these can make a big difference to the enjoyment and involvement of people like your children, your mates, your players and your fans. Now, after all that, how can you not do something? <laughs>